Welcome to this little data walkthrough. In this video, we're going to show you how to install the connector for Google Analytics and also uninstall the connector. Here you can see that benefits for the app include complete sales data, checkout funnel tracking, accurate marketing attribution, and a recharge integration for subscription tracking. After installing little data, merchants will be able to see all this data directly in Google Analytics, and that includes in Google Analytics 4, which is the newest version of Google Analytics. Now you'll navigate to the Big Commerce App Store. You'll click on Get This App, and that will take you to the Install page. Here you'll click Install, and here you'll see what we're requesting access to for your Big Commerce Store. You'll go ahead and check that box, and then you'll click on Confirm. And this will start the install process. You'll then see the Google Analytics version that you could send data to. We'll show you how to install it for Google Analytics 4 and Universal Analytics in this video. Here we're going to add the measurement ID in. We give you instructions on how to find that, and then you'll click Continue. From there, you're going to add the measurement protocol API secret as per the instructions. And then you're going to insert the web property ID since we are sending the data to Universal Analytics as well. This step would be omitted if you were just sending it to Google Analytics 4. And here's where you'll disable the native Google Analytics tracking. This lets you replace the default tracking with little data server-side tracking, which captures more events in more detail. And that will update the tracking code and you are all set. Now we'll show you the data pipeline settings in app. Here you'll be able to click on settings, you'll go down to data pipeline, and you'll see your Google Analytics 4 settings are already there. These are the information that we put in during the install. You can also see the property ID. You can anonymize IP. You can see Google signals. And you can add extra linker domains in here. Those are the settings within the app. Now, uninstalling the app is extremely easy. All you're going to do is you're going to click on My Apps. And then you're going to click the Uninstall button. You're all set. And you've uninstalled Google Analytics Connector.